Picture a bustling airport full of people rushing around amidst a sea of suitcases. And the parking lot's packed to the brim, too. Now, how on earth do you manage to deliver food, drinks, and other essentials to such a chaotic air hub? It's no walk in the park, let me tell you. Anna Daroy from Magway crunched the numbers. A warehouse-to-airport route often eats up three to seven hours for drivers. But fear not, Magway has a fix for that. They came up with these pods that glide on magnetic cushions through special tunnels, some even underground. Each pod can haul up to 250 kilograms of cargo, cruising along at a steady 50 kilometers per hour. Sure, they could hit speeds of 300 kilometers per hour, but efficiency is key here. So, what do you think? Is that a smart idea? Let's talk about the Chinese supercar Yangwang U9. Sure, many will rave about its four electric motors pumping out a total of 1,287 horsepower, and about those scissor doors reminiscent of a Lambo. But what really steals the show are its mesmerizing dance moves and jumps, all thanks to the Dysus X system. It's like a gourmet dish packed with top-notch ingredients such as Dysus P, a smart hydraulic body control system. Dysus A, a similarly smart subsystem for managing pneumatic elements. And Dysus C, adaptive shock absorbers on all wheels, each independently controlled. The Chinese are confident that their creation outshines anything from the West. Forget about Mercedes' e-active body control, Dysus X is the real deal. And when it comes to performance art, this supercar's dance routine deserves top marks. Welcome to the French city of Nantes. Here, you'll find numerous ancient landmarks, such as the 13th century castle, and of course, the Jules Verne Museum, honoring the famed writer's roots. However, since today's focus is on technology, let's pause at one of the city's intersections. Here, they're testing the smart LED markings by Flowell. The results are amazing. Not a single incident causing injuries or property damage during the tests. Plus, Flowell alerts pedestrians about approaching public transportation, enhancing safety. There's yet another benefit for pedestrians. While only 67% of drivers yielded to them with the old markings, now it's 94% with the new ones. From Nantes, let's hop over to Madrid with the help of a time machine. Last year, the Spanish capital hosted the Under-19 Women's Basketball World Cup, and we're seeing how specialists geared up a rather extraordinary arena for the event. They installed the ASB Glass Floor, claimed to be the most advanced and unique flooring system in the world. Essentially, it's an LED floor that can display scores, charts, highlights, and even games to keep viewers entertained during half-time. Not only is ASB glass floor 1.8 times more durable than fiberboard and 2.5 times tougher than hardwood planks, but it also ensures 80% less slippage than conventional floors, even in wet conditions. Whether you're at ski resorts, vineyards, or campgrounds, the monorack transportation system has got your back on the steepest slopes and the toughest trails. Capable of carrying up to 500 kilograms of payload, it fearlessly tackles 45-degree climbs while cruising at 2.5 kilometers per hour. Thanks to its modular design, replacing passenger seats with cargo boxes, including tippable ones, is a piece of cake. Despite its simple appearance dating back to 1976, simplicity is the secret to its success. Plus, 
Customers have the freedom to choose between gasoline and electric versions, making it an environmentally conscious choice. On April 1st, Razer unveiled Cthulhu, a gaming chair adorned with eight tentacles. The idea was that these tentacles would assist players with tasks like shaving, brushing their teeth and eating, ensuring they stayed glued to the screen. It was all in good fun, but as they say, there's a truth behind every joke. Meet Papras, a backpack equipped with four robotic arms showcased at the IROS 2023 Robotics Forum. These arms can be controlled using upper body movements. Now, what do you think could be some practical applications for such arms? According to the Chinese calendar, 2024 marks the year of the dragon. What better timing to unveil the first Dragon 12 Tidal Power Station? Located off the Faroe Islands, it adds a unique flair to the assets of the Kingdom of Denmark. Sure, it doesn't resemble a fire-breathing monster, but looks aren't everything. Efficiency is key, and Dragon 12 delivers. With a power output of 1.2 megawatts, it's 10 times more powerful than its predecessor, the Dragon 4. Power travels directly to shore via a 3.4km cable, and this is just the start. The company has plans to expand, aiming to inject around 200 megawatts of tidal energy into the region. $400,000 raised on Kickstarter alone. That's what I call success. And it all started with this device. Not too hard when you've got two engineers on board who used to work at Samsung. The device in question is called Glamos. Pop it onto any screen and it instantly responds to gestures. Essentially, it's like touchscreen but for gestures. Glamos detects hand motion within a meter radius by flickering at a speed of 40 frames per second. It's like turning your hands into a mouse cursor. Weighing in at just 18 grams, Glamos easily slips into your pocket. The price on Kickstarter is $100. Imagine an outboard motor swapping its propeller for a membrane. Sounds like something straight out of an engineer's nightmare, right? Well, it's actually real. Meet Fins, a motor inspired by nature, mimicking the graceful movements of jellyfish and dolphins. On the outside, it looks like something between a hairdryer and a lamp. Inside, it packs a 72 amp hour battery. Its capabilities are humble for now. Even at a leisurely 5 km per hour, a full charge can only take you 39 km. Its max speed is 11 km per hour, but here's the kicker. No gearbox, crankshaft or any other unnecessary parts cluttering it up. Plus, the membrane lasts two years and can be swapped out in a couple of minutes. All this for $3,447. What superpower would you choose? If you said invisibility, we've got some exciting news. The Invisibility Shield team is now selling their invisibility shields, with the 2.0 version being lighter, stronger, and more effective. But be prepared to shell out some cash. The shield measures a meter in height and 70 centimeters in width, and it's priced at $377. It's crafted from polycarbonates, housing a lens array. Here's the gist. The light reflecting off the wearer's body gets drowned out by the light reflected from the background. This creates an optical illusion of high quality, 
So much so that the Shields even made an appearance on a South Korean TV show. In the past 40 years, we've witnessed the transition from disk phones to smartphones, and from fax machines to brain-computer interfaces. However, there are still 30 million people relying on wheelchairs. That's enough. Wondercraft has developed the world's first self-stabilizing exoskeleton, enabling a natural gait. What's more, it can be customized to fit your specific walking style, aided by AI algorithms. With this exoskeleton, individuals can walk backwards, sideways, turn around on the spots, and even run. It's an excellent solution for various scenarios, including stroke rehabilitation. This robot is tailored for landfills, evaporation ponds, heat leach pads, and other sites where controlling leaks is crucial. It surveys at a rate of 0.5 square meters per second, proving effective on various surfaces like clay, sand, gravel, and geomembrane. It can detect leaks up to a meter deep. It's fully autonomous, and it employs the latest search methods, powered by artificial intelligence algorithms. Additionally, it generates reports on its own, eliminating the need for human intervention. In challenging situations, the remote control can be activated. The Harbor Scout robot family is equally intriguing. It aids in exploring underwater terrain. Take the Harbor Scout 55i, for instance. It strikes a good balance between compactness and versatility. Measuring 140 centimeters in length and weighing 25 kilograms, it's equipped with an improved brushless motor and smart battery, enabling it to operate for up to eight hours on a single charge. The 55i can be outfitted with equipment like an echo sounder, GNSS navigation systems, LiDAR, and other useful tools. One of its standout features is the autopilot. Moreover, it comes with an integrated Windows 10 running PC, simplifying preparation for work and facilitating quick data analysis. Next up are utility locators, crucial for identifying and surveying utilities before horizontal drilling. They play a vital role in preventing workers from damaging power cables or pipes. Typically, these systems consist of three main components, a transmitter probe, a handheld locator, and a display. The ease of operation largely depends on the range of connectivity between these components. For instance, with the HDD Subsite Marksman system, the locator can detect the operator's display from up to 610 meters away. Thanks to its powerful beacon, it can detect cables and pipes at depths of up to 40 meters. A major advantage is its one-switch operation, eliminating the need for unnecessary buttons and levers. The research that led to the development of the Da Vinci robots began back in the 1980s, with a working prototype crafted under a contract with the US Army. Fast forward to today, and behold the Da Vinci 5, their most advanced robot yet, taking surgery to new heights. It's not meant to replace doctors, but to assist them. With Da Vinci 5, surgeons can work with exceptional precision, reducing force on tissue by up to 43%. Compatible with a wide range of instruments, from endoscopes to scalpels, it caters to various specialists, from surgeons to gynecologists. 
Its main advantage is easing the burden on doctors and optimizing their work without compromising treatment quality. The Reactant Fire Suppression System manufactures the world's most dependable fire suppression systems, fitting them into everything from machinery to factory floors. They offer various options, like the system using FM200 gas, which is colorless, odorless, and doesn't conduct electricity. Ideal for areas with people, it leaves no residue after extinguishing fires. Alternatively, they offer systems with special powder that forms a crust to deprive flames of oxygen. In tests, reactant fire suppression systems activate 100% of the time. They're already installed in many facilities worldwide, from a Mongolian coal mine to school buses in the UAE. The yoga mat has evolved to become aquatic, offering its owners an entire island experience. No kidding! The largest mat in the Aqua Lily Pad series spans up to 5.5 meters and can support up to 680 kilograms without sinking. That means that it can accommodate about 10 people. It's like having a floating republic or a pirate base, whichever you prefer. However, Transporting it requires some effort, as the mat weighs 16 kilograms. On the bright side, it rolls up easily thanks to the FlexCore technology. This mat can be yours for $615.